uh, the Pac-12 conference has been down for such a long time that uh, no one was really expecting them to have enough fight when they wanted the teams to have enough fight to come back and win the game. And that's why I think that's why we beat Kansas or, or for, that's why we beat Florida. And I think that's why we beat uh, we ended up beating San Diego State because we had that extra push right there at the end to uh, try and win the game. And we almost won this game. We almost beat Oregon. We almost beat the Oregon Ducks. Um, the uh, we had a, a three point. Uh, you know we were we were down by what so eleven points at one. You know not too not too close, uh, very close to the end, and uh, we fought back, and we were able to get get it to within three points, and uh, then um, Nick uh, Johnson was trying to, he was trying really hard to get down the court and uh, get a shot off, and he, they stole the ball, um, Oregon stole the ball, Oregon had ten steals tonight, which is a big stat for them. Uh, that's one of the reasons why they did so well tonight. Um, and Oregon had 10, 10 steals, and we had four steals. I'm going off on what ESPN says here. Uh, I can also go off on what CBS Sports says, but I think it's a little bit more, um, a little bit more correct if it's through ESPN. But I'm not sure. You know, I could be wrong. Um, I think the, one of the big things was that uh, Oregon is not known for their three-pointer, uh, three-point shooting, but they ended up shooting 63, uh, about 63% from three-point land, um, and we only shot 42% from three-point land, which is not bad. You know, it's better than the average, which is average is like 33% from three-point land, but still, you know, it. Uh, that was, uh, those were daggers. They were killers. They were difficult. The, you know, if you get thou, that and you get blocks, if you get, if the U of A gets, gets blocked by Oregon, by the Oregon Ducks, then it's also, uh, uh, really hard on your, um, ego and just, uh, it, it, it's really wears on you at heart, makes you not want to try as hard uh they had six blocks and we rebounds and another thing i wanted to tie into that is free throw attempts so we only had uh 11 free throw attempts and the oregon ducks had 17 free throw attempts um i i've said before i think that the free throw attempts should be with somewhere around 20. I think the University of Arizona should get at least 20 free throw attempts. Um, we only, the the reason why I'm saying that is because I think that shows some guts, that shows some strength, that shows some uh, fight in your team. If you, if you uh, it depends on, you know, if you, the more the more times that you get to free throw, free throw line, I think it's better if you, I, I think it's better for your team because it shows strength, it shows not willing to, the unwillingness to give up. Um, but, you know, they had 17 free throw attempts and we had 11 free throw attempts. So, you know, they, they beat us on the free throw attempts. And taps and and uh, it's just, they, the Oregon Ducks they just wanted this game more than we did. Um, the only one that I saw that was and that was really really willing to well there was two actually that were really really willing to push this game. I wanted to see how Kevin Perrin was going to handle uh, Oregon because he's never really played against them. Uh, in in the new uh, Ma Matthew Knight Arena, and so I was wondering how he was going to deal with it, if he was going to come out strong. Um, 
and he did. He came out pretty strong. He he ended up fouling out actually. He tried he tried really really hard, but um, you know he could have get a get on on. And he, he usually like I said he usually has a bunch of offensive rebounds, but he he had zero offensive rebounds. So I don't know what was going on. He I think he was just really really frustrated. So. I expect to see him have a bunch of offensive rebounds whenever we go up against Oregon State on uh, Saturday, I think it is. He, uh, let's see, he, he fouled out. But the, the other one that uh, was really, was a, played a major impact on this game, uh, well, Lions did, of course, but uh, Nick Johnson, he really, he took it in his... He took he put the weight on his shoulders right there at the end. He tried to get back in this game really really hard, but you know whenever he was dribbling down the court uh, after that uh, rebound um, and going for that final shot, that final three point, because we were only down by three, and he was just trying, he was just going for it. There was like five uh, Oregon Ducks that were on him and and. They were, you know, hounding him while he was trying to dribble and get, and haul butt down the court, and and uh, you know, one of them kicked the ball out one way, and the other one grabbed it. So one of the Oregon Ducks kicked the ball out, and one of the or one of the other Oregon Ducks grabbed it. So you know, it was just really hard on Nick Johnson. He 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 couldn't he couldn't pull it down, and the in the end, and you know that. A situation like that, it's really your seniors that you want uh, that can really handle that pressure, like Mark Lyons or Solomon Hill or Kevin Parham. I really was kind of hoping that Kevin Parham would get in there, uh, would be able to shoot that final three-point attempt because we were only down by three um, at one point, but then at the end, but uh, Kevin Parham had already fouled out, so that wasn't in the cards. Um, but uh, overall, it was uh, it was a pretty good game. I, you know, I have to say, you know, that I'm upset that the U of A lost. But then at the same time, it was not a big loss. It was only we only ended up losing by four to the Oregon Ducks. Um, and you know, honestly, I really, I really thought that Oregon was gonna was gonna win this game even before the game started. But uh, it, we just, it, like I said, like I've said before, I talked to the radio guys before. It's just we had a, we have this bullseye on our back, 14 wins and zero losses, and everybody, and their mother is is saliving, is salivating at the at the mouth, and you know, tr- waiting, you know, to play against us, and they're gonna bring out their A game and. And that's I think that's what Oregon the Oregon Ducks did. So Oregon wins this game, 70 to uh, the University of Arizona, 66.